Boom. All right. So it's half past five. Um, and just waiting for Chris to arrive, our surrogate bear runner for this evening. Paul's unavailable to uh, run the 10k <laughs> today. So we've got Chris here. He's going to um, grab hold of the mantle and see how we do. Um, got my new top on, North Norfolk Beach Runners. Quite chuffed to be wearing that. And yeah, I'll do an honorary time check again. It is 5.34. Don't do it as well as Paul. Um, and yeah, so we're off to Reefham. Um, Reefham 10k race. Um, come on, let's see how we do. Let's see how we do it. It's my kitchen. There we go. Some people looking into my kitchen. Random. Uh, but it's all good. Little bit nervous, hence the verbal diarrhea. Um, but yeah, we'll give it our best shot. Um, so back in a bit. Boom. <laughs> Also, I'll just add, it does feel slightly weird going to an event without Paul. So a little to message to Paul, a little message to Paul in the future. Uh, let me know what you're doing when you watch this, when you're watching this, and watching me knowing that you're at home doing something else. Um, it's very peculiar, but yeah, might eat a banana. Um, yeah, might do that. Boom. A little rundown of equipment um, before we go. Um, so, literally, shoes, chewing gum, watch, and water. That's it. That's all we need. That's all we need, because running is free. Running is freedom from this crazy world. That could be Chris. So yeah, we're here, Bear Runners, here with Chris. Evening. And we have just arrived in Reefham uh, for the 10K, and we're going towards the car park here. Hopefully, uh, hopefully fingers crossed. Uh, caution runners, yeah, this looks right. Um, yeah, somewhere along here, I reckon. Nice Mind you, saying evening. that, yeah. Not too cold. Yeah. So, too what? Warm. What are you? What are you hoping for tonight, then? Um, firstly, to finish. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, secondly, to try and get sub sixty. Okay. Um, see how it goes. Yeah. Yeah. Do sub sixty, you'll smash that. And uh, hopefully, see you. Your PB. Yes, fingers we'll crossed. Fingers crossed, and here we are. Yep. We are arriving. There we go. And this is Chris's first race. Yep. First and Official my race. second. Look at that, it is a rave. We fit a rave. <laughs> Great. Could well be, wouldn't it, tonight? Yeah. So here we go. Um, should mention that Chris has taken Paul's place for tonight. Very lucky to have him here. Um, although I do wonder what Paul's doing right now. Um, probably eating dinner. Feet up. Feet up. Glass of wine, yeah, maybe. glass of wine. Visit to Fallen Angels. You know, who you knows? Big breakfast, maybe. Having that. <laughs> but um, yeah, we shall see. So we found ourselves here at the race, at the reef from 10k. Chris is looking spectacular, Thank you very much. as always. So we'll see. We we'll see what we need to do. This is toilet break. Toilet break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Number one or number two? Just. Yeah. <laughs> Start a check. We can have a bit of a warm up. That's it. No. 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 
No. <laughs> no warm up. No. Yeah. Okay. Just have cool, a bit cool. of a stretch. Have a, a, have a stretch. pint maybe. Just <laughs> yeah. pint the pasty snap. before we yeah. go, yeah. Sounds good. Vindaloo. Yeah. Let's crack on with that, yeah. It's <laughs> a lot of high vis around. If I have a warm up I'll be too tired. Yeah. Wipe, yeah. wipe me out. Yeah. I see many beer tents. No, there's not, are there? No. Right. No. Right. There was at Worcester because it was part of the festival. So I was kind of, yeah. Didn't fit, yeah. Felt tempted. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Jake Woodbury, North Norfolk Teacher on this. All right, amazing, thank you. Uh, oh, sorry, mate. Three. Sorry? Something seven and eight. Yeah. yeah it's got a of minutes. So if you come and got like a game plan to this, we'll just run it or just like yeah. <laughs> I think when you get the miles away, that's why I'm trying to speed up a bit. Okay, yeah. So I've been able to tell you this is the first bit, and then that's what I'm trying to do. Maybe we'll do 200 metres fast. Yeah, 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 yeah.
So we're here after the 10k North Norfolk Beach Runner. What's your name? Daniel. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. so what, how, what did you think of that? How did you feel? Um, yeah, it was a good start from road, which is quite yeah. nice. Um, in about, for about 5.8 mile, a K in, about 6 K, you go onto trail, yeah. which is when it gets really good. Yeah. Um, and that was just a, um, all the way home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Pretty flat, a yeah. few hills in it, but not too many. Yeah. Um, at times, when it got to the trail, it got a bit more compact, but yeah. the first half it was roads a bit higher yeah. people that we needed to. Yeah. But yeah, it was a good run. Uh, weather's nice tonight. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Look at it. Man. Yeah. Look at this. Perfect. Yeah. Um, yeah. What, what was the thing about, like, because we were talking at the start about, I was saying how I often go out too fast. Yeah. And you didn't this time, and I followed that. And I helped, that helped. What do you think it is about that that's a benefit? What is it? Why is it better to do that? I think the thing is, it warms you up into the race for start. Okay. Um, rather than going full in. But yep. also, more importantly, I think you can spend all the energy because it's actually a lot harder going around people and trying to weave through people. Yes, than it yeah, is yeah, yeah. Them. Okay. So, I think you can waste too much energy, I think, doing that. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. I think that's probably hard to battle, really. Um, and also, I think, I think it's a psychological thing because obviously you're going to hit a wall at some point. Yes. And if you, if you, if you only got you know, a couple of K or an hour or two left and it's yep. a lot easier to manage rather than yes. still got five Very miles true. Left, you know, so Very just, yeah. I found that when I did the Worcester Five, I hit that barrier far earlier on yeah, yeah, yeah. and saw people passing me, whereas yeah, I hit the barrier later yeah. and like, you're not going to manage it a bit better. Yeah. So can we see your thing to fellow North Norfolk Beach runners with our thing? So here we go, man. And that's Bear Runners. Bless you. Boom. All right, come on. Let's get a picture. Let's get a thing of this. So, Bear Runners in full effect, man. I'll take a picture for you. Come on. Bless you. Yeah. We did it, man. We did it. One love. Well done. Well done, man. We did it. Oh wow, yeah, brilliant. I don't know what to like, what to choose. Sorry? I'll have a cheesy foot. Yes, please. Um, what do you recommend, like? Well, put the strawberry on, whatever that is. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that looks like a good choice. No, you go. No, 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 you get. I'll go. You've got that. All right, there we go. We've got one of these, ladies. Thank you so much. Is it possible to have a um, and oh, thank you. And I'd love a uh, coffee as, as well, please, if that's all right. That'd be amazing. Home, eaten, showered, do a time check. Um, it's 11 13 p.m. And yeah, eating my own body weight in pizza, I think. Um, it was a beautiful race, lovely race. Got a PB um, for the 10K and got one of these. Met some really, really lovely, like minded people. Beautiful evening. Come on, you can't beat that. Um, and I'm sure I will chat to Paul about the experience. Um, before we put the video out, but yeah, um, amazing, amazing, and I missed having Paul there, man, <laughs> that was crazy, it was like half a limb missing, um, Chris was brilliant, it was lovely having you there, my friend, um, as the surrogate other pet, bear runner, but missed having Paul around, um, but there we go, man, Onwards and upwards, I'm going to have another hump for some, for the next races, see what there is to come, and great to talk to all the people I talked to this evening. Alright, peace out.